massive, massive Dallas welcome to the cast of Dexter, Michael C. Hall! And I'm like, okay, thank you. I get down and I go 
go back out, and then they're like, actually, can you come back in again? I go back in, they're like, can you do the laugh again? <laughs> I think that's what got me to jump. My wife and I at the time, because we watched it actually religiously, we had the soup and bingo. It was right for everything, so thank you very much for filling our cards at least once in every couple of episodes. Hi, Yeah, I um, finished doing um, Six Feet Under, and I thought the last thing I wanted to do at that point was another television show, and uh, especially uh, one that would have me once again surrounded by dead bodies. But um, <laughs> I read the pilot script, and I was like, what am I, an asshole? I'm definitely doing this. Um, it was, it was unlike anything I'd ever encountered. I didn't know if it would find an audience, but I definitely had to, uh, had to do it. I mean, it, it was uh, unlike anything I'd ever seen. And for an actor to have back-to-back -back shows, whether it's movies or TV or whatever, where it's a career-defining event from day from 16 under to next to Morgan, it's just like an embarrassing bridge to that. Yeah, I, I, um, I, yeah, I, I have shit on both of my shoes, I guess. I stepped in it twice. Um, I'm very, very lucky. Um, six feet under ended, and everybody thought I was a fastidious funeral director, and uh, I think David Fisher might have been Dexter's first victim. Um, <laughs> you know, because everybody thinks I'm a serial killer now. Not really. I know you guys don't think.